Hey guys, it's me, Skylar Capri, and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing update number two of my February Project Use It Up. The background's different because I am not in my usual filming location and I just kind of had to make it work, but I wanted to get this video up today because Sunday is Project Use It Up day, so let's get right on into it. So we're going to start out with the hand soap. I'm currently using the Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte hand soap. We started right here. And now we are down to right here. I only have a little bit left and I think I'll be able to use this up before the end of February. I think I have one and a half-ish weeks. So I feel like I'll be able to just knock this out and then I will have finished two soaps for the year. So very exciting. Um, next I have the hand cream. So I'm using the Black Cherry Merlot hand cream. I don't have any progress on this. It started right here or it started up here and now we're down to right here. So we're about halfway down. I just wasn't really in the mood to use this this week and I think that's because I was really focusing on my body cream and using that as hand cream as well, which the progress on that's pretty good. So I'm very excited to show you that, but no progress on the Black Cherry Merlot hand cream. Next we have the two hand sanitizers, so Raspberry Tangerine and Marshmallow Treat. Didn't really use Raspberry Tangerine because the focus was on Marshmallow Treat and we started this one completely full and now we are down to right here. I'm sorry about the glare. I'm using a ring light for the first time. So I'm trying to kind of work with that. I'm also not in my usual filming location, so I'm not really sure how it's going, but I wanted to get the video up and I wanted the lighting to at least be decent. So ring light it is. Um, so this one started all the way full and now we are past the like bath and body, past the little, um, I guess like where it goes out and we're past the packaging line. So we're doing pretty good on this one, especially for a smell I'm not too crazy about. I feel like I did a good job on this one this week. So that seems to be everything that's not body care. Now we can get into the body care. So we're gonna start off with the fine fragrance mist. So the stuff that doesn't really have like a match in this project. So starting out with my beautiful day full size fine fragrance mist, you guys know how long this has taken me, I started like right up here and now we are all the way down to here. We're making such good progress. I wanna make sure you guys can see that. So the first line was right here. Last week we were right here and now we are right here. So I only have about a finger width more. I have been loving this. I think this is a great scent for this time of season where it's not like super cold, but it's also not springtime. It's like that weird in between. Some days are really cold, some days are like semi nice. So I have really been enjoying this and I really wanna finish this by the end of the product, which I think I'll be able to do. So there's Beautiful Day. And then the other one I have was Pinkberry Clouds. If you guys have watched any of the last videos, you know that I'm not the biggest fan of this one, just because it goes very artificial and smells very artificial for me. But I was able to sort of mix these two. This one's really kind of fresh florally and this one is very sweet, very artificial. So by mixing these two, they kind of balanced each other out which I really liked. So this is the Pinkberry Clouds Mini Fine Fragrance Mist. We started right, we started all the way up here, but we started last week right here and now we are down to right there. So we made a good amount of progress and hopefully I'll be able to finish this one by the end of the product as well. If I use the same amount I did last week, this one will be gone. So I just need to sort of push through this one till the end of February and then I can put another fragrance mist or whatever in the project. So happy about my progress on that one. So now let's do the two full size items I have and I'm happy to report that these two are both finished up. Oh, that's embarrassing. These two are both finished up. So this was the Everlasting Magic um, shower gel and the full size body cream. So these were from the 2023 Halloween drop and these had scent notes of Bejeweled Berries, Phantom Petals and Magic Musk. This one smelled to me like rose jam with a little bit less rose and a little bit more jam. So I really love these. I really love this set. I think this would have done really well in February. I think I mentioned that in my like February purchaser pass video. But um, yeah, I'm so happy to have these out of my collection. It's not so much that I didn't like the scent. I love the scent. I was just getting a little bit worried with the cream color. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like kind of yellowing if you can see that. And that doesn't mean your product's bad. It's just the vanilla scent in a lot of their body creams tend to hit yellow. The body creams have a shorter shelf life than the lotions. So the body creams, I believe, are like two years, while the lotions are maybe four years. So 
that's just something to watch out for. For me personally, it's a problem because it stains my robe. I have a white robe and after I shower, I put lotion on, then I put the robe on and I really didn't want my products staining my robe anymore. So I just wanted to get these out of my collection that were already turning. Again, nothing wrong with them. It's just like a color change from the ingredient in it, but still something that's annoying. So happy to have these done. I'm not sure what I'm going to be putting in the project. I'm at home right now, so I don't have like my whole collection here with me. And I don't know why I just didn't bring the next set in. Usually I'd introduce it right now, but I guess we're just gonna have to wait until the next update to figure out what I replaced this with. Now onto the final three products. I have a whole Into the Night set. So I have the body cream, the fine fragrance mist, as well as the shower gel. So I used the shower gel last night and it's at the t it's at the mark where I marked it when I guess I marked it wrong. I feel like I probably tipped the bottle down to mark it, but it's right there. So we have a good amount of usage on this one, over halfway, and I think I'll be able to finish this one up. Again, with this one, I wouldn't usually be using minis unless I'm traveling. This weekend, well, this weekend I'm traveling. Um, but this one is also starting to yellow a little bit. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see it. It looks really white on camera, but it's yellow in person, and I just don't want it staining my robe. So I have these three in this set. No progress on either of these two. This one's super hard to mark. I've been kind of marking it at the side, which isn't a really good way to do it. I might just take like a really thin box cutter and kind of cut the back of the package so then I can see the progress. That one, that might be a good idea. But as far as the body cream and the um, show, or fine fragrance mist go, really no progress with the body cream. We're about right here. And then the fine fragrance mist, I'm assuming we're about right here, if I had to guess. So that concludes my update. We have two products completely finished, which I'm thrilled about. I'm super excited to be adding some of my other spring sort of fragrances into the project. I think I'm going to add, if I had to give like a guess is what I'm to be adding, I think I'm gonna add the Hello Beautiful Shower Gel because that's the only one I have. I have Hello Beautiful Winter Candy Apple and Cucumber Melon in terms of body bath and body works. Those are the last three that I have. And I bought all up at summer semi-annual sale, didn't buy anything um, at winter semi-annual sale. So I'm sort of like on my stock that if I go each month using the same amount of product, that should get me to summer an annual sale, which then I can just get a restock. So I might do Hello Beautiful, I might not. We will see in the next update, but I hope you guys had a great weekend, are going to be going into a phenomenal week, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.